was it to kill Cruella? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> how did you feel about that? Je veux savoir qu'est-ce que la question continue à faire. Qu'est-ce que vous pensez du fait d'avoir tué Cruella? Well, <laughs> personally, as Jennifer, I wanted Victoria to stay around in Vancouver, so that was not, uh, you know, a, a happy discovery in the script in terms of uh, feeling like I wasn't going to have a friend that I really enjoyed with us up there. En ce qui me concerne, moi personnellement, en tant que de Jennifer, euh, je suis très contente d'avoir euh, Victoria euh, qui soit à nos côtés euh, à Vancouver, donc euh, j'ai envie que ça dure, euh, ça dure plus longtemps, donc je n'étais pas forcément euh, ravie de, de découvrir ça dans le, dans le script. Euh, je préférais qu'elle reste parmi nous parce que j'ai découvert une, euh, vraiment une véritable amie. Um, in terms of what it meant for Emma, um, obviously she's really embraced fully the idea of being Henry's mother, and it was truly the most raw representation of her primal love for her child, that she would do anything to save him and protect him in that moment. Um, so I think that that is the absolute culmination of what she's worked toward in terms of wanting to be a true, true mother to Henry. personnage d'Emma, hein, ce qu'elle qu souhaite, euh, c'est vraiment de, de devenir la véritable, véritable mère de, de Henry et de, de s'en occuper, de prendre soin de lui. Euh, donc finalement, Cruella représentant euh, un, un danger pour, euh, pour son fils, voilà, c'est vraiment l'expression de, de sa maternité et de, de la volonté de protéger son fils. Mais en plus de ça, c'est évidemment qui se passe pendant un temps où Emma est challenged emotionally. She feels betrayed by her parents on a very, very deep level. She feels very guilty that um, the way her parents tried to protect her meant that Lily had a bad life. Um, and uh, there was just so much hurt and anger and loss and fear um, that had been building inside of her up until that point that was boiling over. And it was it's a lot of things that she's never faced and she's never dealt with in her life. And so um, I think it's a very um, interesting moment to be able to look at Emma and realize that even though she did it from a very primal place of protecting her son, that uh, magic really does come with a price. And so the magic that is within her uh, makes her capable of things that maybe she doesn't want to be capable of.